Lexus GX, J150 2009-2021 The GX460 debuted in China at the Guangzhou International Automobile Exhibition in November 2009. The redesigned model continued with body-on-frame construction, full-time four-wheel drive, an electronically controlled high-low transfer case, and a torsion center locking differential. The kinetic dynamic suspension system, KDSS, became standard. Power came from a new 4.6-liter Winnerf AV8 engine producing 224 kilowatts, 301 horsepower, and 446 Nm, 329 pounds-feet, of torque, mated to a new 6-speed automatic transmission. Fuel economy was improved over the prior generation, while maximum towing capacity was 2,950 kilograms, 6,500 pounds. The drag coefficient was reduced to CD equals 0.35. The rear wiper was hidden under the rear spoiler, and while the tailgate remained side opening, a flip-up glass panel was added. The interior added a power folding, two-passenger third row which folded flat, allowing capacity for up to seven passengers, with the second row sliding or tilting for third row access. Because the third row was no longer removable and used additional space, cargo capacity declined. A toggle switch replaced the transfer case's floor-mounted shift lever, and the gauge cluster added a steering wheel angle display for off-road situations. Similar to before, a Mark Levinson sound system and two display rear seat entertainment system versus, were optional, while three-zone climate control, semi-aniline leather, and heated second-row seats and steering wheel were new options. Like its predecessor, Rear Adjustable Height Control AHC, air suspension was offered on the GX460 with an Adaptive Variable Suspension AVS, system and Hill Start Assist Control hack. Additional electronic aids include an LX570's Grawl Control System, Downhill Assist Control DAC, and Active Traction Control a track. The torsion differential distributed a variable torque split when left unlocked, including a 40 colon 60, front rear, ratio under normal driving conditions, a 30 colon 70 ratio during cornering, and a 50 hours 50 minutes ratio when rear wheel slippage was detected. Added safety features included whiplash reducing active headrests and 10 airbags, including front knee airbags and rear side torso airbags. New safety options include a pre-collision system, driver monitoring system, lane departure warning system and Lexus Inform with Safety Connect telematics. Optional cameras located at the rear door, rear view mirror and passenger side mirror provided views of the vehicle's sides. Low beam head headlamp projectors were offered with an intelligent high beam feature which automatically dimmed the high beams depending on traffic conditions and an adaptive front lighting system AFS that swiveled the headlamps and corners. On May 28, 2012, Lexus China announced the market launch of the GX400, which replaces the GX460 in China. The engine option is now changed to the 4.0-liter 1GR V6 engine that outputs 202 kilowatts, 271 horsepower, combined with a 5-speed automatic transmission. Due to the power reduction, it takes 9.8 seconds for the GX400 to accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour, 0 to 62 miles per hour. Compared with the outgoing GX460, most standard equipment on GX400 remains the same. However, in November 2017, the GX400 was discontinued in Chinese markets. On April 13, 2010, Consumer Reports in the United States urged customers not to buy the 2010 model year GX460, giving it a don't buy, safety risk label, its first such vehicle rating since 2001, following the results of a liftoff oversteer emergency test. This label was lifted on May 7, 2010. In the high-speed test, the SUV was quickly turned with no pedal input causing a sideways slide before the vehicle stability control VSC, initiated a full stop. Consumer reports said that the VSC acted too slowly, and if a wheel hit a curb or slid off the pavement, a rollover accident could occur. 
the shared platform Toyota 4Runner passed the test, and while Consumer Reports said it knew of no actual incidents, it recommended a software fix. The same day, vehicle maker Toyota expressed concern, thanked the magazine, and temporarily suspended GX460 sales. While noting that the SUV met all U.S. federal requirements, on April 16 Toyota confirmed that its testing had duplicated the results. On April 19, 2010, a voluntary recall of the GX460 was issued, along with the left-hand drive Land Cruiser Prado, for a software update to fix the VSC response. With the software update in place, sales resumed on April 29. Vehicle stability control had been criticized by Wheels Magazine for slow response speed on such models as the Toyota Kluger, known as the Highlander in North America, while Drive noted that VSC had also been set to intervene too soon. The Wall Street Journal pointed the lack of VSC a decade ago. In September 2013, the GX received a first facelift with the Lexus spindle grille design, new LED headlamps and LED daytime running lights standard, LED fog lamps are optional. In the US pricing has been reduced by $4,750. In 2016, for the 2017 model year, the Lexus GX added second row captain chairs with the luxury package. In 2019, for the 2020 model year, the GX received a second facelift with a redesigned, more angular spindle grille along with new triple beam LED headlamps. An off-road package is also new, which consists of a 360-degree panoramic view monitor and multi-terrain monitor with four cameras, a transmission cooler, a fuel tank protector along with Lexus own crawl control and multi-terrain select. Additionally, the interior gains new trim options, and safety features part of Safety System Plus are now standard on all models. In 2021, for the 2022 model year, the GX received some minor changes, one of which included a new infotainment system and a redesigned dashboard.